Let's talk about what to do when you get a broadcast error in Switcher Studio. Every so often when you're live, you might see a pop-up message that says stop recording and broadcast or continue recording as your two options. Um, the error is usually something around transmission being an issue. Um, most of the time, the reason this is happening is because the network has dropped out for a moment. Maybe you had too much traffic on it. Too many people are connected. That's a good way to troubleshoot so this doesn't happen in the future. Um, but if this does happen to you while you're live, not all is lost. You can still go live to that same video player, no problem. Um, and let me show you how to do that. So as you can see right now, I'm live to Facebook. Um, just doing a private test stream, and I'm going to simulate one of these errors by turning off my Wi-Fi. So this is going to act as if my Wi-Fi has completely dropped. As you can see, my camera now isn't connected anymore. Um, that's, of course, because it is connected over the Wi-Fi. Um, so after a little bit of time, that error message is going to show up here. Okay, so here's the broadcasting communication error saying transmission failed. So if I want to go live again, I'm going to tap on stop record plus broadcast. I'm going to tap the go live button again immediately. Um, what this will do is your viewers who are watching will just have the video buffer for a second, but then it will start going live again for them. So uh, this is a great way to do it that way so you don't lose uh, your live video. Now I will mention that um, your video recording will be broken up into two pieces. So the one that is saved on your switcher device is this one right here for me. Um, if the recording is way more important and you're just going live just because of it, um, you can actually do the continue recording button that will not break up the recording. It will stop the live component altogether and you will just be left with your recording in Switcher Studio. So that is not interrupted at all for you. So that just wraps it up again. Um, stop recording and broadcast and then go live again. If you are looking to, uh, keep that live video going. And of course, if the recording is more important for after the fact, um, just use continue recording and the, the live video will stop. Thanks for watching.